So the other day I heard that um, jackfruit was a really easy tree to grow. Um, I saw on YouTube a guy who grew one and it started bearing fruit within 18 months. And also I think I saw somewhere that it was really easy to grow, to grow grows in poor soil. Um, it's a tropical tree of course, but I thought I'd try growing some anyway. And over here you can see one, two, three, and four that are in soil. Now the three of them are growing really well and fast. It's been about uh, maybe six weeks I would say from uh, you know taking the seed out of the fruit um, and the only one that hasn't really gone anywhere is this one for some reason now I got the method from garden tips on YouTube so you take the seed like that from the fruit and you wash it off and you just put it in some paper towel in a closed container All right so I did that and these have been sitting here for about a month and in my kitchen which is about probably 24 degrees all the time Celsius of course um, and I took the the ones that sprouted first or germinated first and put them on top of the fridge as you noticed the fridge is a lot the top of the fridge is a lot warmer of course now as you can see there's one getting tall here uh, some of the others are still just starting to sprout and I did a little bit of an experiment because in garden tips they showed putting them in the uh, white paper towel uncovered so these ones have been uncovered but the ones under here have been covered and I wanted to know if they would germinate faster now it seems that there is not much of a difference actually so as you can see it's pretty much the same thing the top portion was covered the bottom portion was not um, and it is a good idea to keep the medium quite uh, moist now as you can see let's take a look at this one the the uh, stem will grow out of the seed like so and the root will come out of the seed like so And what I wondered, and I couldn't really find the answer online, was that it has what appears to be cotyledons. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly, but like basically the first leaves or baby leaves that collect, uh, start to photosynthesize for the plant before the uh, true leaves can come out. But I'll show you that it doesn't seem to make a difference whether those these two leaf-like cotyledons or whatever they are are exposed to light. So as you can see, the jackfruit baby tree uh, or seedling emerges like that. All of them do the same thing. Emerges like that from the seed and it leaves this large portion of the seed still uh, intact. Now, if we take a look back at the plants that are in dirt, I planted all of them after they sprouted 
after they started to germinate. So this one and this one have those uh, cotyledons exposed and they got darker but uh, you know judging by the size of this one it didn't really make a difference in this one as well but these two I planted them right into the soil and those immature leaf-like cotyledons were not exposed as all, at all and the the first true leaves are starting to come out of this one and this one as well So all in all, a pretty fun thing to do if you come across jackfruit. And the, uh, the taste of fresh ripe jackfruit is, as well, very delicious. Hope that gives you some ideas and uh, enjoy your jackfruit.